history. Every city has a complex history that is the foundation of its present society. In Domaguete, the best place to explore that history is the Domaguete Vent Fry. In its heyday, this beautiful stone tower helped save Domaguete during pirate attacks and also called citizens to mass. Today, the Domaguete Belfry is one of the city's best-known landmarks and is thought to be one of the oldest surviving structures in the city. It can be taken as granted that the clock tower is with the Bolivar, the number one tourist attraction in Domaguete. In the year 1811, when Domaguete was a place whose inhabitants were always threatened by mostly marauders in search of slaves, the bell tower was then built to forewarn the locals of an incoming danger. It remains to be the oldest bell tower in the Visayas and is a very famous architectural landmark in the city. Governance the governance of the city is called good governance because of a good leadership, management, accountability, and of course, unity. Lifestyle the city of Domaguete is the hub of culture for the islands of Negros. As the capital of the Negros Oriental, it's the central meeting place for all of the province's people. The locals have a fairly high standard of living and are quite well off in addition to being friendly towards Torres and polite. Communication with the older people, though might be a little difficult as they mostly speak their native language. Culture of a place is a reflection of its society. It tells us about the people of the place, their lifestyle, and their beliefs. Observing the culture of Domagetti gives you a fair idea about the traditions and practices that are still followed by the locals. Domaguete, a city of gentle people, is already a well-known hub for tourism and communications. The city, however, is looking to further develop its infrastructure. The Campanario de Domaguete was built upon one of the four original massive watchtowers that Paris priest Don Jose Manuel Fernandez deception built in the 1760s to discourage Moros from pillaging the town. The two layer which are now known as the Bell Tower or the Campanario were added during the administration of Pre Juan Felix de la Encarnacion in 1867.